Hello guys, my name is Asmarant and this is more 49ers news and this is big breaking 49ers news on this guy. Yes, as you can see, ESPN.co.uk forward slash NFL. Um, sources, Fred Warner, 49ers agree on a five year, $95 million extension. So, let's read. Santa Clara, California, the 49ers took care of their final piece of the big season, uh, the big off-season business Wednesday, agreeing to terms with Fred Warner on a contract will make him the highest paid off ball linebacker in NFL history, sources told ESPN's uh, Adam Shifter. Warner and their Niners agreed to a five-year, $95 million deal that includes $40.5 million guaranteed, sources told Shifter. The uh, $19 million average annual salary surprises the, the previous high of 18 million year held by Seattle Seahawks line, uh, linebacker Bobby Wagner. Warner's $40.5 million is the second highest uh, granted total of an off-ball linebacker, training only the uh, New York Jets CJ Mosley $51 million, according to ESPN's stats and information. The 49ers announced the extension on Thursday but did not disclose financial terms. Uh, we're extremely excited to have completed a long-term contract with uh, extension with Fred uh, prior to the start of training camp. General Manager John Lynch said in a statement, Fred brings the type of leadership and energy every day that our defence and team feeds off. He earned, he earned this extension through hard work, discipline and the professional way he goes about his business. We took forward to watching him continue to play at an elite level or, uh, for us as well into the future. Now it's time to go to work. Uh, Warner thanked the 49ers on Thursday tweeting, we're only getting started. Fred Warner's tweet says, Wow, honoured and blessed to remain faithful for years to come. Thank you to Jed, John, uh, Park, Carl and everyone for believing in me and allowing me this opportunity. I thank everyone who's helped me bring to this point in my career. We're only getting started. Go Niners. Uh, the deal comes six days before the 49ers scheduled to report to training camp and ten days before they start practice on July 31st, which was always uh, viewed as an official deadline with uh, for Warner and the team to complete a deal. Warner 24 left little doubt that he wanted to get a deal done this past May during organised team uh, activities when he said he wants to be a Niner for life. A third round pick in the 2018 draft, Warner ranked several, uh, seventh in the NFL in tackles 366 and is one of the two players with 250 plus uh, solo tackles 252 and 15 plus pass breakups 16 since then along with Wagner. Uh, Warner finished last season with 125 tackles, a sack, a false fumble, uh, two fumble recoveries and two interceptions as he earned his first Pro Bowl and all Pro nods along with the Niners' two most uh, prestigious team awards. Warner joins tight end George Kittle and left tackle Trent Williams in landing record-setting contracts for their position in the past year. Kittle reassigned just before last year's training camp and Williams agreed to his deal with the Niners in March. Uh, getting Warner's deal done also helps reset the market for his position. As the, uh, Indian uh, the Indianapolis Colts, Darius Leonard and Chicago Bears, Regnan Smith are also due for their extensions too. So, this is only part one of the um, article. So what I'll tell you about part one of the article, I cannot wait for this season to start. I cannot wait to see this guy play. I want to wait for Trey Lance. I want to know what is, when's his contract coming up. You know what I mean? I want to know if we've got him and how long for and so forth. But I'm loving that we've got Fred Warner for another uh, for those years. Nine to five million dollars. That's a lot of money. And that's wicked. Now that's only part one. Part two is this. So as you can see, this is part two. Niners linebacker Fred Warner's uh, contract has a unique structure with two deals in one. Now this is on Ian uh, Rappaport. NFL.com. Um, let's have a read. 49ers linebacker Fred Warner became the NFL's highest paid inside linebacker on Wednesday, but a closer look at the mega deal uh, lingers how uh, luxury the deal really is and could be. As Mike Ruffalo reported, the base value of Warner's deal is five years, $95 million. The extension also includes $40.5 million guarantee, but that doesn't that uh, doesn't tell nearly the whole story thanks to a unique structure that essentially makes it a two-in-one deal. Here is how. The first deal was a five-year extension in which the two final years automatically void to make it a free extension. Under that scenario, it's $54.9 million in new money over a three new years, $18.3 million average. That, uh, that escalates the three-year extension Seahawks linebacker Bobby Wagner signed in 2019, which is for 54 million, 18 million average. 
Using the four-year total for Warner's deal, he gets 40.5 million guaranteed of the 58.5 million paid out over the total of four years. At 69% of the contract, uh, the contract guaranteed compared to Wagner's 61%. Uh, the second deal is the 49ers can buy back the final two years. They have avoided by paying Wagner 21.85 million in 2025. Under that scenario, the, the new money total will, will become 76.8 million, 19.2 million average. If Warner plays out the entire contract, it's a five-year extension for 95 million, which is a 19 million average. That still makes him the highest paid at this position. The deal's creative uh, structure provides Warner a ton of security up front with a record-breaking short-term extension that is nearly 70% at, uh, guaranteed. Plus, it also gives the 49ers a choice to make a few years down the road. That's on Ian Rappaport. So that's bloody good. That's a good deal. And uh, the 49ers make a bit of money down that line. Um, fantastic. I'm glad we got Fred Warner. I'm glad he signed to it. And I'm glad that he's staying in the Bay. Um, I can't wait for this season. I've got um, a big announcement on, f on the 30th of July. Keep an eye out on what I'll be doing on the off-season and the regular season. So keep an eye out on that as well. Um, guys, thanks for guys for watching. Read the article. Tell me what you think about the article. Um, let us know. I can't wait. Uh, thank you very much for the 39 subscribers. Really fortunate, humble, and yeah, really appreciate you guys subscribing. And if you're new, subscribe. So with a lot more 49ers news, a uh, bit of NFL news here, there, and everywhere, and um, a lot of live streaming as well. When we're getting to live streaming, that's why I want you to watch a video on the 30th of July. So, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys out on the next video.